piss off out of here. You're talking to an elder. So show a little respect, you prick licker. Respect for you? This is no place for crappers like you. Out, I said. Aye, true. Join the pigs in the pen, that's your place. Best leave. Old Maverick ain't a good companion. Unless you're looking for someone to mock. What I saw back there, that happen often? What's the problem? I've bigger problems to deal with than the camp tramps. My nightmares have invaded my waking life. The specters haunt and hunt me by day. Come on. Nightmares are common. Start at the beginning. One night, I... Walked to the riverside and sat there, staring at the stars. I must have fallen asleep. I dreamt of my birdie, her milk white bosom, her gentle voice. I saw and heard her as if she sat beside me, and then that voice became a terrifying whisper. Curdled the blood in my veins. I opened my eyes, but the spectre remained. It went on talking, hovering over me, stretching its mitts out towards me. I felt a deathly chill, and then it happened. What? Never been a coward. At the fore and fierce in many battles. But a human's one thing. A spectre's another. No other way to put this. I shit myself. Out of fear. Pants right full by the time I got back to camp. Since then, they mock me. Call me the Crapper. I'm not surprised, to be honest. What else do you want? I want to ask something else. Ask away! What time did the Spectre appear? I went to the beach after my watch, so it must have been an hour before midnight. I've no idea how long I slept, but when I reached the camp, it was dawning in the east. Why did you go to the beach? During Hensel's last expedition, we stayed in a house there. My unit was on the lookout for Demaven's forces trying to cross the river. I just wanted to recall the old times. So you took part in the campaign three years ago? Took part? I barely escaped with my life. Leva, the brothel medic, saved me. Talk to her if you want to learn more. She knows everything about the camp. I'll deal with the Spectre, but you should know a Witcher's services don't come cheap. My soldier's pay is meager. Got but a few coins in my pouch and some pipeweed. Will you do it for that? All right.
Oi, Witcher! Out in these wastelands, hunting monsters? Well, if you see two of my men, tell them I'll rip them both brand new assholes if they miss muster. What are they doing there? It's a common malady. A day don't go by that some dimwit don't sneak out of the camp to go to the gullies. We'll see if I come across anyone. Luck be with you. You're a good fellow. Ah, find them and you'll see Corporal Zivik knows how to be grateful. I thought it was here yesterday. Guardians a few years back. Now we make camp with the black ones. That's politics. I see you finally decided to relax. Have I ever told you I think you lead a very unhealthy life? You've mentioned it. Evidently not enough for you to take it to heart. Anyway, the whores are quite decent here. Maybe some other time. You worry me. My memories and feelings seem inextricably linked. I seem to be recovering both. I believe Yennefer's alive, and I'll eventually find her. Triss? Yennefer? That's some life you lead, my friend. First off, we have no idea if Yennefer's still alive. Second, we have no idea if Triss is alive. Hmm. True. You seem to have two women, when in fact, you don't even have one. Their kind doesn't die easily. I'll find Triss as soon as I've dealt with the assassin. What about Yennefer? I won't know what to do about her until I see her. Henselt's camp is abuzz with rumors about the events three years ago. When you burn a sorceress at the stake, rumors spread faster than the seed of a lascivious baron. I know you primarily value sorceresses for their firm busts, but I'm curious. What do you think of Sabrina Glevisig? Sorceresses complain about feeling underappreciated, persecuted even. But let me tell you, Geralt, you live by the sword, you die by the sword. If they didn't meddle, they wouldn't be burned at the stake. They keep whining about the horrors that took place on Thanet Island about the order of the world being destroyed. But let me ask you, who brought that about if not them and their scheming? Heard anything about Letho? They say he's hiding in the ravines. He's not alone. I know. I fail to comprehend exactly why you have it in for him. He escaped, so what? You're no king, and as such are hardly in danger. I'm tired of having to explain that I'm not the Kingslayer. Hansel believed you. But he's still not sure, and I don't want him doing me any favors. Let's say you catch him. What then? I'll decide once I've heard him out, learned the truth. Maybe I'll see his point, or maybe I'll just cut off his head. I wonder what Sheila's doing in Henselt's camp. You're not alone, because she's wondering what you're doing at the King's side. How do you know? She asked me about you. What did she want to know? I have no idea. I realized right off she was sniffing, and told her she could smell my fingers if she wanted. But that'd be all she'd get. And she gave up? Mm-hmm. See how careful I am? Have you tried to, uh, approach Vess? I've thought about it. On the one hand, I've never rogered a soldier, but on the other, the clean clang of steel against steel and an intimate moment could put off even the most attentive lover. Why do you ask? I'd just like to know. We should have our sea take an interest in things. Or it will turn out like the mill in Stiltum. The one the smith from Jailmo took over when he married the miller's people. Are you Leva? If you've got a growth of some sort and you're here for the salve, get in line. Nothing of the sort this time. You were here during Henselt's previous expedition. What of it? I have some questions. Be quick. Half of Henselt's nobility's waiting for this salve. They've all started pissing blood out of longing for the spouses they left at home. The ravines around the camp. They don't look like they were shaped by nature. They're proof of the great power sorceresses can summon. 
Sabrina's fireballs scarred the ground for many miles around the battlefield. I'm interested in that tower. It's the remnant of a man I sacked long ago. They call it the Tower of Debauchery, since Madame Carroll made camp at its foot. Did many soldiers survive the battle three years ago? But a handful. The rest were just vaporized. Those who could walk dragged those who couldn't. All the survivors were horribly burned. Three years back it was the home of Malgut, a healer and his family. While he helped us tend the wounded, someone murdered his children. Malgut couldn't come to terms with the tragedy and threw himself into the river. The children were buried behind the house. Their graves should still be there. I'll let you get back to treating all those brave fighting men. Greetings, Hansel.
You're not the one we seek. Though his aura is strong, even on you. Impossible. I watched Maverick wash his pants. Who are you? I'm a witcher, and I'm here because you haunt an innocent man. You've ruined Maverick's life, and it's high time you left this world. Maverick? Innocent? That son of a bitch murdered me and my two sisters, then threw our bodies off the cliff. Our father, Malgut, died of despair. Fortunately, fate has brought Maverick here again, straight into our hands. Revenge shall be ours. I need to find out if you're telling the truth. If your story checks out, I'll bring Maverick here.
distance. His more Watch yourself, Harold. The elder and the recruiter are coming for you. He was. Life can be really strange. I fought the Nilf guy. Driving me crazy. Have you managed to do anything, Witcher? The Spectre claims she's the ghost of one of the sisters you murdered. They're out for revenge. Is that why you wanted my coin? To talk rubbish? You're no better than them, you freak! Away with you, demon! Well, it was here yesterday. Audrey, where are you? Still looking for coins. Audrey, what else am I to do? This mystery. Have you managed to do anything, Witcher? The Spectres manifest themselves even when you're absent. They've burrowed deep into your subconscious. If I killed them now, they'd return instantly. So I need your help to destroy them. If there's no other way, what would you ask of me? Meet me at the beach an hour before midnight. What else am I to do? Oh, this mist's driving me crazy. I was here yesterday. Life can be really strange. I fought the Nilf Guardians a few years back. Now we make camp with the Hagrids. That's politics. What's it called?
you have finally returned, brother. Time to atone for your evil deeds. You shall surrender to us your soul. Kiss my arse, Phantom. You'll not make me shit myself this time. Me and the Witcher will dispatch you where you belong. Naive little Maverick, made a fool of your entire life. Isn't that true, Geralt? What? What are they talking about? The Spectres say you're their brother, and you murdered them three years ago. What do you say? How can you even ask? I'm a soldier, not a murderer! Denying it is not enough. You need to prove your innocence, and I need to know the truth before I make my choice. I never murdered anyone! I'm a soldier! I kill foes, not women! I'll take your word over that of evil spirits. Now help me. Finally returned, brother. Time to atone for your evil deeds. You shall surrender to us your soul. Kiss my arse, Phantom. You'll not make me shit myself this time. Me and the Witcher will dispatch you where you belong. Naive little Maverick, made a fool of your entire life. Isn't that true, Geralt? What? What are they talking about? The Spectres say you're their brother, and you murdered them three years ago. What do you say? How can you even ask? I'm a soldier, not a murderer! Denying it is not enough. You need to prove your innocence, and I need to know the truth before I make my choice. I never murdered anyone! I'm a soldier! I kill foes, not women! Take your word over that of evil spirits. Now help me. Oh! 
finally returned, brother. Time to atone for your e- Kiss- Night- What? Don't listen to this nonsense. Just help me kill them. I'll not forget what you did for me. I did it for coin. Small price for peace of mind. Don't you owe me an explanation? I want to hear the truth. I was born by the very border. General van der Grift understood that I knew every blade of grass here. So he appointed me lead scout. We were based in my family's house. This house? One day, I scouted beyond the river. When I returned, I found my father digging the graves behind the house. What happened? Honor was everything to him. He had brought us up, taught us principles. And then one day, Adernian soldiers arrived and undid all that. Shamed his children. He could not stop himself. He swore he did not do it. But there was blood in his clothes. We fought. He fell from the cliff. Why did the Spectres want your soul? Maybe they've no tolerance for patricide. Maybe. Now go back to camp and present proof of your valor. Take back your dignity. <laughs> 